back, boys and girls. We have missed you. My name is Mrs. Zimmerman. I teach first grade at Maple Ridge in Community B. And now we're going to be doing some teaching online. So I'm really excited because I get to teach reading and I love to read. And I hope you do too. We're going to be learning about author's purpose. Remember the acronym PIE, P-I-E. P is for persuasive writing. Authors sometimes write to persuade us, or they may write to inform us or to just entertain us. Also, we're going to be comparing and contrasting as we read, and that'll be fun too. I have a surprise for you, and I want to share with you what that is. But before I do, I want you to close your eyes and think about what my surprise might be. Close your eyes. Okay, open them. Here is my surprise. I went down to the pond today and I found these in the pond. They're frog eggs, or sometimes they're called frog spawn. And our books and our lessons for the next couple of weeks are going to be talking about frogs and toads. So I'm excited about that. Did you make that prediction? Did anybody guess frog eggs, that that's what I had? I'm sure not because that would be pretty tricky. But I also have some books about frogs that we're going to be learning about. This one is one of my favorites, Five Green and Speckled Frogs. I also love Arnold Lobel, Frog and Toad. This is Days with Frogs, Frog and Toad, and I think you're going to love it. One last book I have to share is Frogs from um, National Geographic. And this has a lot of good information about frogs. So we're going to be learning about it, and I can't wait to begin reading with you. So in the meanwhile, be sure to work hard, be nice, and take no shortcuts. See you soon. Bye.